Hello everybody. This is an astrological forecast for Scorpio for May 2011. And this also applies if you have a Scorpio ascendant. So Scorpios, this month the focus is going to be on your work, your relationships, your career and your money. So let's start with your work because this month, is, uh, particularly for the first two or three weeks of this month, there's a lot of planets in your sixth house of work. So um, it's a good time to put energy into your work. It's a good time to be very creative in your work. With Uranus in that sign, it may, it may mean you've got a lot of varied things that you have to do. You've got to get your head around a lot of different things. You've got to learn them very quickly. You may have to learn to be more adaptable in your work, but it's going to be a good time to move forward in your work area. Now, between the 11th and the 13th of May, we've got Venus conjunct Jupiter in your house of work. So this could be good news in work. Something nice, somebody nice, um, a growth experience, a promotion, um, a new opportunity, a new person a new teacher coming into your life in your work area and stimulating you. It could be an exciting time in your work area. So this could be um, a good time to push yourself forward in the work area because I, I'm seeing some more opportunities there. So for those of you that may be feeling a little dejected or a little bit so things are not happening, um, I think this month you may well find that things start to, uh, opportunities start to come in again that haven't been there for a while. Now they may come in and out. You're going to have to be quick on them. You're going to have to be quick on the mark because with Uranus there, it gives it you, but it takes it away just as quickly if you haven't moved on it. I need to give you that warning first. Neptune in the fifth just slipped in there last month. So remember to do a lot of the creative things that you're so good at, Scorpios. All the creative things that you enjoy, if you like music, if you like art, if you like sculpture, if you like theatre, whatever it is, it's a good time to develop that more inside of you because it's going to help you through the turbulence of the times that we are living in. And I know being a fixed sign, Scorpios, you don't always find it easy to go along with a lot of changes and there will be a great deal of changes ahead. So develop that creative side of you and it will give you a nourishment in these times of change and it will help ground you through it. So do that. Develop your leisure activities and if necessary make them into a business that can bring you an income. As well we've got a lot happening in your seventh house of relationship this month Scorpios. So gonna be a lot happening in your relationships if you want to make yourself heard or you feel you've not been listened to then any time between the 20th and 21st of May is going to be a very good time. A lot of planets coming together at that time where you can break through. So um, also a good time for meeting somebody new. If you're looking for a partner or you want to um, get, your get an, an old relationship rekindled, very good time for that to happen, particularly um, over the middle two weeks of the month. It's going to be a very good time and also a good time to meet somebody who is very charming, who is very lovely and also somebody with whom you can communicate, where there's a, a real nice flow of communication. So make sure you get out and about. It doesn't have to be very big functions. One-on-ones are going to be important this month for you, Scorpios, and they can move you forward and also be very exciting and very interesting to you. A few closets, a few skeletons coming out of the cupboard, possibly, and a few things coming back maybe to haunt you from your past and it's important that if somebody or something does come back from the past that you try and analyze what were you supposed to learn from that especially if it was a more challenging experience really think about what you needed to learn from it so this month new opportunities in the workplace make the most of them because they're, they're there fleetingly but they are there so be ready to be more proactive and also some new things coming in as far as relationships are concerned. A very strong possibility of somebody new, interesting and charming coming into your life. So there you have it, my dear Scorpios. I wish you a great month and I thank you very much for listening. Bye for now.